This video shows you how to install the education version of LEGO Mindstorm programming software on Windows machine. First, we have to make sure we have uh, enough uh, disk space on C drive. Uh, we need uh, one gigabyte for downloading and uh, probably two to four gigabyte for installation. So just uh, check the C drive properties and you will see your free space available. And then go to the website click uh, Mindstorm view downloads and select your language and then just click download waiting for the download to complete once the download completed click to open the file it will automatically extract and start the installation process quite some time. So it started. Uh, first uh, we choose the directory to install. We accepted the D4 directory. Just click uh, next. Then we select a uh, teacher's edition. It's not very different, just uh, more stuff. Then uh, we need to accept a uh, couple of uh, license agreement. Just click uh, accept and uh, next. To it. And then we'll see the installation process started. It'll take uh, quite a while. Once the installation uh, completes, it will put a launch icon on your desktop. Just double click it to open the application. First time, you probably need to allow the uh, network access. Just click OK, and then you will see the application launched. Um, you can uh, play around. Click uh, the top left uh, question mark to get uh, on screen help for the start of the screen. So first, let's uh, create a new project, and then you will get a different uh, editing screen for the programming. You can also uh, click uh, the left, uh, top left uh, question mark for the on-screen help. So a little bit more stuff, and then you can play around to try out some uh, programming blocks. Let's try out some uh, motor actions. Display and so the speaker. Uh, 
Talk to include some stuff. Let's save our uh, project as a test. You can also play around with the other uh, programming palette for more advanced programming blocks. Good thing is uh, if you click uh, the help menu, there are online help, for example, the user guide and the EV3 help. Basically, the user guide, you click it. It will open up uh, the operational menu for the EV3 brick. Just go through it. This will tell you how to connect uh, the motors, how to operate the motors, and uh, how to connect the sensors, so what, what are the on-screen uh, display help. A lot of stuff. Or also there's uh, easy to help about the programming blocks. Uh, a lot of uh, different sections. You can open up a section to take a look. Let's take one example. For example, you want to see how to program a large motor. Select a large motor. And then here are the instructions how to put different parameters to control the large motor block. Pretty much it. Thank you for watching.